A keen sportsman in his early 20s, Adidas founder, Adi Dastler, was a cobbler by trade. He quickly turned his attention to making shoes for athletes. We'll have a look at yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, can I hold it? Boot. This Adidas football boot was worn by a German player in the 1954 World Cup final. Germany were underdogs that day, but they had one man in the setup who made a difference. Adi Dassler um, was the kits manager for the German national team. Now, that day in Bern, it was raining and pouring down with rain, so both Sepp Havig and Adi Dassler decided to use these synthetic studs and put them in these shoes, which gave the Germans the ability to move more agile. Germany won the game. A decade later, it was athletics' turn. Track and field was changing from using an ash track to one made from rubber. When it rained, athletes were more likely to slip. So what Adidas did is he came up with an idea and went to his wife's washing machine, emptied the liquid of the washing machine, poured it onto the new surface, and therefore allowed that test to take place and happen. And Simply uh, it worked. It worked really well. That shoe <laughs> was phenomenally successful at the Olympic Games in 72. And even 16 years after its founder's death, the company was still innovating. What does a table tennis bat have to do with this boot? A football player called Craig Johnson from Liverpool FC, he was playing table tennis and he was, while doing that he was thinking of giving more grip to football boots. Boots made famous by that master of the set piece, David Beckham. <laughs>